Welcome back to VID Machine. You're watching for Sly Guy, Sly Guy, Sly Guy, Kaboom, Kaboom, and Super. Kaboom, oh yeah. Kaboom, oh yeah. Kaboom, oh yeah. Here we go. Here we go. Two million euros. Two million dollars. And a paella. And a paella. Miss Spanish score offered. A paella. A paella. And two million euros. You for my her. precious. I have offended you again. So I guess this is the end Because everybody knows you're such a snowflake And you're just quite upset at every single thing we said Everybody knows it's all just in your head Wasted feeling going speaking You know why you crossed the line When I said that you were mine Go and ski and go hard feelings Since you will not be my girl This is me and the my own Welcome back guys to another episode of AD Machine Sly Guy, Sly Guy, Sly Guy It finally happened, good God A Spanish store Let me get you the name of that Spanish store Ah, there it is Gremio de Dragones Or Dragon's Guild In Spanish Spain, Valencia, Spain offered 2 million euros or 2.5 million dollars for the one ring and a plate of Spanish paella. My god, this is getting crazy and the hype is just getting crazier and crazier. This is a new card from a new set which Wizards can print at any given time. You can reprint this card anytime you want. And the value of a card is just shooting through the sky. And I think people are just going crazy. They've lost their minds. Because what are you going to do with it after you buy it for $2 million? Let it sit in your store? Just like have it like bragging rights and say, hey, I got the one ring. I'm the big time guy. I'm the big boss. I'm the guy, Mr. Moolah, lots of cash. Oh, yeah. I mean, what's it for? Two million euros can get you two McLarens in Dubai. I kid you not. Two luxury sports cars. You can buy two Lamborghinis, two McLarens, two Porsches, two... BMWs or even three BMWs and or even though you can even get like uh, if you just get like a regular car you can get one regular car a condo a house and you'll have money to feed yourself for the rest of your life so you don't even have to worry about money for the next 20 years or so I mean why spend that much on a brand new card compared to this card a gem minty alpha black lotus is worth half a million dollars alpha black lotus now these alpha black lotuses okay they were they were rare at the time that they were released limited print run then through time a lot of them got destroyed leaving just a few left kind of like that action comics number one with superman right Back then, they were everywhere. But then, uh, because of a war, people were donating because they were destroyed, and only a few really minty copies are left. And uh, Babe Ruth baseball cards, Mikey Mantle baseball cards. I mean, you get the diff, okay? This thing is. It was just printed recently. It didn't stand the test of time. Um, it wasn't collected way back then. And I doubt it if anyone would actually... Any Magic player, like 20, 30 years later... If any Magic player would actually pay $2 million to get this. And instead of getting an Alpha Black Lotus, which is uh, the sheer power of the actual... Which represents sheer power in the actual game. I mean, it's a good artifact and all, but it's nowhere near the power level of a Black Lotus or a Mox or a Time Walk, which you can get from much cheaper. I mean, why bid that high on a card from a new set, which you can get cheaper versions of? 
which um, that, that makes you draw cards. I mean, yeah, it tempts you. You lose one life. You draw a bunch of cards, kind of like. Well, why not just get a Pyrexian Arena? It costs one mana less and it does the same thing. I mean, good God. People are just losing their minds over this card. And uh, actually, um, right now, instead of even hoping to open the One Ring or hoping to get that $2 million, I'm going to be more realistic. I'm just going to get a plate of paella. Once again, this is the Idea Machine with the Sly Guy signing off right. Tsh!